Welcome or welcome back, Cyber Explorers. It's Alfie, and in this video we'll explore together with this step-by-step -step guide, how to fix MBR boot issue when system reserved and OS are same partition. So without further ado, let's get right into it. Please note, the procedures outlined in the video are specifically for a Windows system that's installed on an MBR disk in one partition only, meaning the system reserved partition and OS partition are the same partition. If you're having a problem booting into Windows on an MBR disk, where the system reserved partition and OS partition are the same partition, then get your Windows 10 installation media, like a USB drive with a bootable Windows installation on it, and boot to the USB drive with legacy BIOS mode. When you install Windows either on an MBR or GPT disk on an allocated space, Windows will take care of creating the partitions needed. But in the case of MBR disks, if you did the partitioning manually and went with one partition, you will end up with only one partition. That partition will contain the system reserved files and the Windows files, etc. So now let's first make Windows unbootable, insert your Windows 10 installation media, and boot from it. On the initial setup screen, click on Next. Then click on Repair Your Computer. In the next screen, select Troubleshoot then Command Prompt. Now type cd forward slash dc colon backslash boot backslash and press enter to navigate to the directory then type jinbcdbcd.bak and press enter to rename the bcd file this will make the system unbootable and you can see the option continue to windows disappeared now let's fix the boot issue insert your windows 10 installation media and boot from it on the initial setup screen click on next then click on Repair Your Computer. In the next screen, select Troubleshoot then Command Prompt. In the Command Prompt, type boot rec forward slash fix MBR and press Enter to fix the MBR. Then type boot rec forward slash fix boot and press Enter to write a new boot sector. Then type boot rec forward slash scan OS and press Enter to scan for Windows installations. Finally, type boot rec forward slash rebuild bcd and press enter to rebuild the bcd then type exit and press enter to exit the command prompt and you should see the option continue to windows appears restart your computer it should now boot into windows normally And that's it for today. If you found this video helpful, please give it a thumbs up, consider subscribing, and don't forget to activate the notification bell so you won't miss out on any new uploads. Thank you for watching, and I can't wait to share more with you. So, until next time, see you later.